Yo, what's going on? It's Tuesday and we're here with another lesson. And I'm excited to bring it to you because a lot of you guys have asked me about music schools, what I thought about it. Um, you guys are asking me questions to see if you guys want to attend, attend school and if this is the best option. So I wanted to go ahead and do a two minute or this one is going to be a little more than two minutes. But go ahead and do, do a, a lesson and give you guys some great information and some of the things that I actually learned while attending music school. Knowing what you're going for. Myself, when I applied for music school, there was this dude that had just hit the scene with Israel Newbreed, Chris Coleman. And a buddy of mine had stopped me in my tracks for the day and said, yo, stop what you're doing. Go get this album right now. Tell me what you think. And craziest thing, I was like 10 minutes away from the music store right down the street. So I was like, all right, got the album. was like, yo, who is this? Being that my friend, he kind of geeks out on drums at times. But he says, yo, this is Chris Coleman. The dudes went to Drummers Collective. And he gives me this whole spill. And I was like, yo. I gotta understand what he understands. An inspiration to me. We'll get into that a little later as well. But I was like, yo, I gotta understand what he understand. Like, yo, if I can get a little bit of that knowledge and apply it to all the stuff I already know, my drummer can go from here to here. And that's what I knew. So I had a goal when I approached this music school. So know your goal. Have a goal. Second, don't just take what's given to you and leave it at just that. So if someone teaches you a groove lesson, let's say we're going to talk about Afro-Cuban stuff. All right, so we're going to do this Afro-Cuban groove. Sweet. Don't just stop there. Go deeper. Always go deeper than just that lesson. If, if, if any of you know anything about Afro-Cuban, it is not a style, it's culture. But you wouldn't know that just by learning some pattern on the kit. And what I mean by a culture, just like you see some of these kids in the US playing in church, coming up in church, that's where I came up from, yes. And they're very young. And in that culture, you see that they actually bring up young kids playing drums and being able to do amazing things musically. And that's exactly what Afro-Cuban is. It's not just this, oh, let's learn this groove. It's a culture. So never just go at the base of what someone's teaching you. Always dig deeper. Third thing is challenging your teacher. Yes, challenging them. Question the mess out of them. Ask a million questions because that's what you're paying for. Your questions should be answered. That's what you're supposed to be there for. That's what your goal is, to get every question answered so you go from being here to elevating yourself. That's the goal, right? Yes. I never met a drummer or anybody that came to me and said, hey, I just want to take lessons just to take them. I'm going to pay you just to pay you just for fun. Yes, it's for fun, but we always want to reach a goal. So I will tell you, always challenge, 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 challenge your teacher to the point where they're even having to do work, extra work. And it's not a bad thing that they're having to do it because, like I said, you have this goal, you want to reach it. So you need to make sure you're digging deep into everything that you need to know. Well, after all that, that's it for this week. We can get deeper into it. If you guys have any questions, go ahead. And there is a link right below for the website that you can go and send those and submit those questions in. I will go ahead and actually answer any questions from this lesson, this lesson. I don't always do that, but I will answer questions from this lesson if you guys have any. 
So if you have any questions, go ahead. Email me through the website. And like I always would want to let you guys know, there's so much more information that I'm willing to give. Uh, a ton of information of what I've learned, what I'm actually experiencing, what I'm going through right now, from practicing to even playing gigs and even trying to improve myself. And uh, we don't get them all in these, these two minutes, but this one is not two minutes. Uh, we don't get them all in these two minute lessons on Tuesdays. So you guys have an option to come on and join the family and, you know, get full access to becoming a, a great drummer, reaching your goals, healthy playing, you know, and reaching your goals in a timely manner. It doesn't take long to actually reach your goals. But if you keep going like this and you keep hitting that brick wall and you're never getting the answers, are you never improving? Are you feel like you're never improving? Then it might take a little longer because all that's going to happen is you're going to keep going in the same direction, hitting the same wall and never getting past that wall. A lot of times someone there to instruct you should be able to help you push that wall out of the way and start seeing the, uh, the improvement in your plan. So if you guys want more information, go ahead, visit the website, and I would love to be able to pour into you guys all the things that I know and I'm learning myself. But like I said, after all that, that's it this weekend. And until next time, this message will self-destruct.